Right, hi guys, I'm back again. Um, this is the renovation of the Castleton Roma HL. Um, second video, just to give you a bit of an update as to how we've gotten so far, what there is uh, done, and what there is to continue. We've basically stripped all the doors, handles, hinges, uh, all the way around the van. Which makes it look totally different, don't it? We've started stripping out the lighting uh, as some of it doesn't work. The window frames, uh, so far, I've measured for new tape, whatever it is that they call it. As you can see, this is old and brittle. So, started taking that out around the window. Had another good old check round for any more damp. Look. Touch wood, I haven't found any, which is brilliant. So I've got that as a repair, which I talked about in my last video. So, yeah, I'm pretty happy with the results so far. Good sand down, as you can see, there's just so much paint, it's just ridiculous. All the um, hinges of just, you know, whoever painted it, basically what they did is they didn't strip it down, and it's caused this. So these will all be stripped down, get them all back up and running, it's going to have new handles, so I'm not really worried about them. So every single door will be sanded down, nice fresh coat of paint, um, and yeah, taking the carpet up, check the floor, all seems to be solid, which is great. Um, cookers all work, so that's getting all stripped down to be clean because obviously hasn't got his glass so I'm going to replace the glass on that but the actual cooker works lovely no problems with that at all as does the oven gonna sort out some better spacing in the cupboards there's a, I found another cupboard under there actually um, but it hasn't got a handle on so I'll we'll sort that out um, fridge most probably got a fable on the front of that I'm not sure yet I'm going to go with that. Um, it's, it, it's a case of, you know, I, I, I'm down to a nice shell now. Everything's been cleared out. Cupboards are all out. As you can see, keeping a nice and warm dryer out. Um, got to order two new fly and blind screens for both of the skylights. Come the better weather, I'm going to strip down the beading all outside. Also around the windows. One thing I did check, uh, which is a good idea, uh, and, and it doesn't take a lot to do, is just as I pull up here, you'll see the wood around the windows is lovely. So that's not a problem. Um, yeah. So uh, apart from apart from that bit of damp there, bathroom. Not even going to look at that just yet. I want to concentrate on this area yet uh, first. Um, I mean, typical what people do is, you know, look, do it properly in the first place. You don't need to do all this. Um, so this will all be changed. Get rid of this and put some decent plugs in. The fabulon what was on top of this is gone. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this just yet. Uh, again. It's a work in progress as to how I go. So yeah, that, um, basically that's how I've got so far. Um, please subscribe, as I will be posting more videos. And also, if you like my video, please give it the thumbs up. Any thumbs up, any subscription is appreciated. Thanks ever so much. Bye.